Okay, I've got a spreadsheet here. I'm a promotional company. I'm working with some bands. I've got details of venues that we play at. And I'm going to organise some bookings for the bands at a venue. Now on this menu page, I'm going to record some macros on some buttons that link to the other tabs. So first I'm going to record the macro. You can simply press record here. Now if you don't see the developer tab on the ribbon, you can get that by going to Excel preferences and then choose ribbon and ensure that developer is ticked here. Okay, then you'll have it. There's various things on here which are relevant to recording macros. When you press the record button, I'm going to give it a name. Uh, let's call it uh, band sheet. I'm going to make it go to. Now you can't have spaces in the macro name, so I'm going to use an underscore. And you can add a description here. You can also add a shortcut. I'm going to assign it to a button, so the shortcut's not going to be relevant for me. Okay, now I'm going to go to the bands sheet and just click in cell A1. And then that's what I want the macro to do. It's recording the actions that I made. So I'm going to stop recording now. Now I'm going to go back to menu. I've recorded that macro. It's all done and dusted. So uh, I'm going to assign it to a button. I'm going to build the button and I'm going to get my shapes here. Uh, you could use the button here on the developer tool uh, bar here on the ribbon, but I'm just going to make my own shape. I'm going to draw it out, and I'm going to give it a different colour, and I'm going to write in, uh, this is the bands sheet, bands. In the home tab, you can centre this uh, and resize the writing, make that a bit bigger, fine. I think that's going to work well for my button. Now, on this button, select the button, control click, or right click if you've got uh, a right click, and I'm going to assign the macro to this button. Now, it was called band sheet. Find the macro you made, OK. Um, now you're in. You're, you're editing this shape. If you click off, then you can see it's an action button. If you want to change something about this shape, you need to right-click on it again, and then you can uh, edit edit the shape. But I don't. I want to click off and use it as a macro, and it goes to the bands sheet there. Another thing you could do is colour code the button. So I'm going to right uh, click. I'm going to change the way that button looks. Uh, let's have it, let's format it as a, uh, yeah, I'll have a red button. And then on the band sheet, I'm going to right click or control click, change the tab color to match that button. So now on the menu, the uh, action button there that I recorded the macro on goes to the band sheet. Have a go at that.